bird on a tree. I'm just sitting here. I got time. It's clear to see from up here. The world seems small. We can sit together. It's so beautiful, you and me. We meant to be in the great outdoors, forever free. herons on the nest slope. Oh, say that and then there's no more. Just got way past about eight of them. There's a heron on the, in the Oh, there's one coming up, there, I think. There's a nest on nearly every post. It's amazing, aren't they? Those nests are something else. Real work of art, aren't they? They last for years as well. There's still one on a chimney in Villa Real that being was there. used that was there five years ago yeah. when we were there last. And it's, which is great, they're still using it all the time. There's one, he hasn't built his yet, look. <laughs> oh, bless him. He's, <laughs> he's just on his own. He yeah, ain't yeah. got the building materials here, but it's short supply in Portugal. Look at that one, look. Yeah. There's a couple just starting out, look. Yeah, just First starting house, out. First house, to let. <laughs> that one's got a gazebo, look. <laughs> <laughs> wow. There's one more coming up here, look. Yeah. It's a spinster, that is. There's another one flapping down here, look. They're big birds, aren't they? Yeah. About the size of a pelican, aren't they? Yeah, look at it. There's a mating down the centre, there. Eh? Oh, it's got chicks in there, look. Oh, a little white chick in there. Yeah. Got to keep watching the road. Yeah. I think we may be a little bit lost. <laughs> <laughs> just, I think we might be on private land. We might be heading to a farmyard. Although we are heading towards water. Which is the initial idea. Which was the idea to head to a river. But I'm not sure. It's not even a Somewhere to turn around. <laughs> it looks like we're heading up into a farmyard there. Yeah, yeah, sure. Geese on the right there, look. Oh, what's this as we come up here, look? Hopefully, there's a road right round it. <laughs> well, at least you can turn around. Or a track, yeah. We may never get out alive. No, I think this is the end. This is the end, yeah. So... Does it not go round here? No, it does, yeah, it's yeah. There's more, there's uh, more. There's another track going out. Right, so which way? This oh way? Oh my goodness, well, I don't know. What are we doing, dog? Oh, bless. We're going to see us because we shouldn't be here. stop because the track came to an end. Beautiful. So we'll turn back. It is stunning but uh... <laughs> we were definitely on private land yeah. and nobody even thought to say. We just just sat there in the chairs looking at us smiling yeah. thinking yeah. they're gonna get stuck. Yeah. But because we've got anti-slip what is it called? Something slip reduction. Slip reduction yeah. <laughs> we uh, got ourselves out of a bit of a tight spot back there where the ground was getting a bit soggy and we were going uphill popped it into anti-slip reduction and we went to zoomed up the hill, didn't we? Yeah. Good old cherry. Yeah. Yes, there's one. We're still on a mission to find a river. 
Yeah, it makes it even more important to, to complete the mission now. <laughs> <laughs> We've been nearly at Montagill by now. Well, I was going to say, we <laughs> messing about. Messing about trying to find a stop halfway. Yeah, this is like driving around the tractor fields in Lincolnshire. It is, it does look a bit like the British countryside, I have to say. We've got to go back, back past these people now. Oh, no. They were laughing at us earlier. It fits. Well, one was asleep in the back of the van. That's a working day, isn't it? Yeah. Sleeping in the back of the van. <laughs> Hello. Well, there's nobody here now, look. So this is a bit bumpy this way. Oh no, he's got out the van now. Yeah, how is he? He's had his siesta. Yeah. It's two o'clock, yeah, so. yeah. Some beautiful uh, countryside. Different again. The landscapes vary so much. Very green up here. Alright, so we're back on a main road now, at last. Uh, that added three quarters of an hour to our journey. We didn't find a river beach. <laughs> and. Uh, yeah, I just think we'll stick to the most state of the roads. Don't want them more. <laughs> Bloody hell, nearly getting stuck. Thank God for that uh, ASR. Otherwise, because when your wheels start spinning, you know that moment of dread you have. But luckily the, ace, the uh, ASR sorted that out, no problem. So we're back on the road and we've still got two and a half hours to go. Hooray! <laughs> Our second castle of the day, I would imagine, is after 700 yards finished. at the roundabout. Take the second exit. Uh, this this castle is in Portel, so I should imagine it's Castello de Portel. What year was it built, Kate? I have no idea. <laughs> what do you take me for? Which regime built it? <laughs> the Oracle. The Oracle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so there it is looking very beautiful. They all look beautiful on a lovely sunny day, don't they? Now, at the roundabout, take the second exit. Look at the size of those mushrooms. Where are we looking? There. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like a big mushroom. After 600 yards, turn right, then turn left. Oh, it's like to the castle, it's gone. Take the third exit. Looks like it could be an old railway line or something. Yeah. Yeah. This is so a just missed all the castle on you. Yeah, that and there's the castle that way. So we're in um, uh, Soa Vicente De Beira. De Beira. Um, we parked up here last night after we've been looking around the area. Uh, beautiful little place with a, a lake. Well, I say lake, it's a dam. Look at this. Look. There's no cars around, so the dogs are just literally running around and doing what they want. It's fantastic. It's pine forest this side, look. That's where the dam comes out. The water comes out of the dam. And here's the actual lake itself of the dam. Apparently, if you want to go fishing, it's about five euros a year. Oh, was it? Yeah, five euros a year for a fishing licence. I'm going walking in my pyjamas. I'm going to have a shower in a minute, so... No point in <laughs> I hope we don't meet the pyjama police. Let's have a quick look around here, shall we?
Right, that's a lovely morning's walk. Beautiful walk, but there's some wildlife up here when it's uh, dark. Yeah. <laughs> so, don't know where we're going today, just gonna put the foot down to the pedal and pedal to the metal and go. <laughs> Wandering winches. We wonder where we like. We don't know where we're going and we don't really give a damn where we're off to. <laughs> Wondery winches and cherry is our home and with our three companions our life is... We love to roam. Is that? <laughs> <laughs> we all love to roam. Yeah, you have got a sneeze on. I hope so. You got another bloody grass seed. The last thing we need, isn't it? Yeah. All right. Let's see if we can find the van again. Yeah. Somewhere yeah. over there. It's somewhere over there on that yeah. bridge. Mm. Oh. I got some crazy dogs. Huh? You yeah, comfy there, Lil? Yes. But it might get a bit sad also. Yeah. It's all good, is it? It's not mm. bad. What are you looking at? I don't know. There's too much of it. There's a lot of water. You see anything good out there? Well, I was thinking that there's a lot of water oh, yeah. down there. Might be a lot of fish. Oh, yeah. And maybe we could catch one, have some tea with the fish. OK. I don't even know where we are. Neither do I. <laughs> We're literally in the middle of nowhere. And we just came across this bridge. It's got a bit of a dam on it, look. And uh, I've just got to show you this. It's absolutely stunning. I'm going to get to it. We've had to drive and park up and walk back to it. So it's a lovely little lake, look. It's the dam. Look at this, look. So I'm trying not to drop you in the water. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, a bit of a drop there, look. All right, and then when we come down here a bit further, I'm not going to spoil the surprise for you. Hang on, let's get a good good angle on it. And then look at this. Look at that. How beautiful is that? That's just incredible. 